Greetings, travelers, and welcome to another episode of Let's Play Xenoblade Chronicles 3 Blind, presented by Draco Breach. We are unfortunately going to be losing um, Ethel soon. I was kind of hoping to keep her on board, but it makes sense from a story perspective, I suppose. Um... If you can't tell by the fact that I'm in this camp, I was Let's wandering around and I found some things. So, probably just bonus experience. Hey, so, can we talk? Hey, so, do you, uh, so you know how there was all that black fog in Benel Cave? Yes. That was, uh, that was pretty bad, right? I only have the information I gained in the survey branch, but it's thought that the fog usually presages and an ally and an an annihilation event. We escaped unscathed this time, but there was a very real chance we could have been caught in it. Really? Irritatingly, just noticing the fog won't be enough to forewarn us of the event's occurrence. Huh? So it's not that quick, Ben? Is this going to be a problem? Well, it could happen anywhere between a few minutes to several years from the time, from the time of observation. There's no direct correlation between spotting the black fog and the timing of the event. Uh, well, that's just great news, in it? Best not get anywhere near it, then. That's about the extent of it. Not that anyone's exactly been diving into it with glee, anyway. Yep, just experience. I've been hoping that these would give you, like, um... A quest or something, but... But that doesn't seem to be the case. Uh, right now, between these two, if the enemy drop boost was higher, maybe. But I can only make two of these, where I can make 11 of these. That does mean that I need to go out and uh, take out some bunnets, but... I'd rather have the CP bonus right now. Is everyone finished? Okay. Next on the list is... Also, I was exploring around trying to get um, items for this. I haven't found any, unfortunately, which means that either... I have not been in the right uh, areas, either a grand area or a smaller area within either, I'm sorry, either a region or an area within that region to get the right items. So yeah, that hasn't been helping, but during that I accidentally discovered a landmark. Um, I thought that I would be cut off from doing this because Tyon doesn't want us going this way, but I figure let's see where we are actually stuck. Oh. Uh, oh, you both. I think Neo's natural agility kind of helps with Ogre. Otherwise, Ogre is not... Ogre is great because it has very high... Um, very high attack. But... Um... It actually kind of has... Um, very low agility and very low dexterity. So if an enemy is targeting an ogre, and I was the MVP. If an enemy is is uh, targeting an ogre, they're more likely to actually take a hit. Okay, this is where we're stopped. Yeah, we're going to get a brief cut scene.
I'm a little confused. I thought that I would have actually been stopped by now. Ah! Progression block in the form of enemies. No, I, that's acceptable. These are, um... This was a nice find! I have forgotten what they're called. Uh, but they're kind of lizardmen. Igna. I am... I'm sorry, this area oh, looks absolutely gorgeous, and I just discovered another location. That is... That is beautiful, honestly. Caterpiles, Ignas, um... Are those... Quad wings, okay. Caterpiles are not normally aggressive. Quad wings usually are. Planning on fighting that. The quad wing dropped something. Oh. Um. Whoa, got a rare dude all right here. That was dumb. That was dumb. <laughs> that was absolutely dumb. Oh, how many things did you drop? Okay, there's some items in this area that I don't remember seeing before. So... Yeah, I need some more ether after making some gems. Oh, do I even want to continue here? I mean, that is gorgeous and I do want to see it. But I'm not technically supposed to be in this area right now, so... Oh boy. Um, caterpiles are not hostile. I've already proven that. Yeah, uh, we might want to rethink taking on that one. Oh, a gogol. A regular gogol and not a unique. This is dumb. This is extremely dumb. Let's harvest some ether. I really should not be doing this, and I know I shouldn't be doing this. But this is also kind of how I play Xenoblade, is I do dumb things. Look out! Careful, everyone! Uh, probably about to get taken out by the drum Gogol if it has a uh, ranged attack at all. Um, that looks like an Asper. No, that's an Igna. What is the range on that Gogol? Let's Time to do, do the right this. thing, eh? Let's do this. Actually, now that I'm thinking about it, there is actually a... Oh! That's different. And that was... Was that an Agnian symbol? Oh... Ah, uh, yeah, um, um... Okay, yeah. No, you couldn't have done more. You just took 2,800 damage. Uh... Was that worth it? Probably not, let's be honest. Although... Maybe? I very much doubt it, but... No, I did find an item. That Jaggy Pecan is new. Still haven't found a, a shaded a a acorn, but that's telling me that it might be in that area that I was just in. Which does tell me quite a bit. Uh, nothing new, yeah. That I found a few new items, but that probably wasn't worth it to go there. Um, and actually, now that I'm thinking about it, let's go ahead and... There's, uh, a husk that I haven't sent off. It's near an elite, but the level is so low on it that I don't think it will be a problem. Like, I don't think it will hostile me, because it's level 12. I think that's what the gray means, is they'll, they'll no longer hostile you. Yeah, they'll, they'll no longer hostile you if they're gray. I, saw, I don't know how I missed this. Beat. 
Yeah, that is slightly different. But unfortunately, because I cannot find any more items, unless some quests open up after I, um... Unfortunately, lose Ethel. Um, I don't know how I'm going to raise uh, my rank to two stars just yet. Um, there might be some husks once I get past the roadblock. Um, it's hard to tell exactly how Such much. A pleasant fragrance. It's got to be pretty close to. Shall we eat? They say an army marches on its stomach. It's got to be pretty close to uh, leveling up to two star, because I got four hundred, I believe, from that hero quest where Ethel, quote unquote, permanently joined the party. And by permanently, I mean temporarily. Um, although, uh, let's... I can't... Uh, that's fine. I'm not upset, I say as I'm upset. But like I said, I, I will try to play different characters. Uh, I won't stick to just Noah, because... Honestly, with this class system, and being able to... to change things every uh, yes and to change things over you know seems like a, a good idea I have to, to go ask ahead and... before you go why is it that you stick together given what's what we pretty much have to considering how everybody attacks us on site now at this point i suppose it just panned out this way you really think so that's not really how it looks to me <laughs> well one thing's for sure. We were sworn enemies once. And yet, we all share the will to live in the now. Before becoming Ouroboros, I never realized. But that common will, it was reason enough to stick together. I see. Not everyone makes the choice to fight willingly. Lance said that you have to. Well, right now every one of us has to. There's no question it would be better if they didn't. Your journey may have started out of necessity, but now you're pushing forwards towards a common goal. And that, that might be all we want, and all that we wish the world could be. What we wish it could be. I don't know if you needed lip flaps there. That sounded that seemed like something that she was thinking, not saying. You're heading out as well. As soon as we're done here, I'll make for the castle. What? You forget, I am the commander. We haven't revolted against our nation, so I have to report in. Ethel, are you sure? Oh, don't worry. I'll be leaving you out of it. That's not it. The Consul earlier turned Mobius. Were it to... If you mean that monster, I'm well aware of the risk. Then why? Because it's my responsibility to those I command. As for the Consul, we can say he died in an accident. Yeah, they're not gonna buy that. And you can't do it remotely. Now that the Consul and Flame Clock are both lost to us, I have to make a report, and not over comms. I have to requisition more supplies, too. And what if... what if they fit you with a new clock? <laughs> I can worry about that then. You're fine with it? Really? Don't get preoccupied with us. Keep to your path. Follow it, wherever it may lead you. Life is short. I suppose. Hey, while we're all still here, one more word of warning. Hmm? The Consul was attempting to remove you from the picture. In light of that, you'll likely come up against hostility. But listen, you should keep engagement to a minimum. Kevis or Agnes, that goes for both of them. But if we break their clocks, just like with Colony 4 here, 
They would... Well, they would be free, wouldn't they? You'd do well to remember not everyone thinks the same as I do, even within this colony. Many still haven't come to accept their new reality. Ah. Uh. To make things even more fraught, in other colonies, there are those who are more than willing to fight, as you'd expect. So it's no use appealing to their sense of compassion, or hoping they'll treat us fairly, is that it? <sighs> yes, precisely. You will change the fate of others just by virtue of coming into contact with them. It's quite the burden. You may not want the responsibility. A burden, perhaps. All that said, you get embers on your coat, you have to brush them off. If push comes to shove, do not flinch. Do whatever it takes, for the greater good. I wish you all a smooth and fruitful journey. If you have to fight, win. Ouroboros, huh? If only we could have been there as well. We should check the root data again, make sure we're on the right path. We're on course for Sword March. But first, we'll need to take the south southeast road through the Ribby Flats. Ah, yes, that's the route that Ethel recommended. Correct. She said the battlefronts are pretty static at the moment, but do we have any intel about colony deployments? As far as Ethel and Colony 4 is con concerned, we've got a pretty good idea, but what about any others? I wouldn't expect any shenanigans all the way out, th out here. In any case, we mustn't let our guard down along the way. Danger could be lurking anywhere in the background, so insecurity stalks us. Not much we can do about that, though. Ah, come on, man. We'll muddle through. Let's hope so. Hey, I mean, if we run into another colony, it isn't necessarily a bad thing. Uh, are you sure about that? It doesn't matter if we run into Agnes or Keeves, either one will be getting into a dust-up. True, but what I meant was... If we destroy their flame clock, we'd set everyone free like we did it for Colony 4. Easy to say. Well, sure, I mean, if conditions allow it. If we're just brushing off embers, we'll have no choice in the matter. That's right. Hey, maybe it's better if we put off worrying about that until the time comes. You need speaking sense there. True, we can just react to events as they happen. Play it by ear. Gotcha, I'll apply myself to that. Okay, so now we're introduced to Affinity Chart, and okay. Colony 4, Colony 9, Colony Sigma. Their copper rank, which is one above Dirt, if I remember correctly. Oh, there's... Oh. Okay, so the ones that are grayed out are dead. And we... Can't see information. No. 
No, can't see information at all. Uh, show wanted items. Okay, so... Can't click on that one. They're not terribly close right now. Level one is slow digestion. Did I see that? Can't see. Item retriever and car caravan call. Hmm. This will make our travels easier. Okay. I didn't see those before. Was that not until I got the infinity chart? Oh, okay, there's my warning level. Um, I'm guessing Keeves is level 2 and Agnes is level 0. Um, there don't appear to be any quests. I'm curious now. can't get to that because that's a high level area. I haven't been able to get to that because you're cut off bait. There's an invisible wall basically here, not allowing you to get up there. Um, no, can't go there yet. That might be completely cut off until later. Okay, that curiosity has been mostly satiated. Um, I'll just walk over here; it's fine. But uh, so yeah, a lot of a lot of things got introduced there. We have the affinity chart. Um, I didn't check. Why didn't I check? Colony four. I'm right here, a commander like no other. Um. Nobody else has a connection. Can't really tell what their general opinion of the party is from this. And you can't see the leaders of Colony um, 9 or Sigma. You would think that we would know who the leader of Colony... Um, Nine is considering that we were uh, basically raised there, but or not, no, we weren't raised. Uh, Noah, Uni, and Jans were not raised in Colony Four, uh, Colony Nine. Um, but that's it. Just spat something out. Oh, yeah, Aspars do that. Which is kind of cool. Um, Not to worry, just stick to the plan. Let's go get our revenge. Somebody want to topple them? I, Come after me, and that's what you get. I guess it doesn't matter. Only you didn't charge off on your own. Okay, so this. Shall we deal with this? You resist knockback pretty well, apparently. Ogre does a ton of damage when it... Oh, okay, so I was not paying attention, but at the same time, you wouldn't have launched anyway. Oh, we can do this! 
Oh, even with... Huh, okay. I... can't get up there. Okay. That ass bar is... That ass bar is stuck on geometry or something. Thank you. May as well take advantage of that while they're spitting things out. I'm hoping to find... Powdered wheat. I think that was an item that I needed. No, there's nothing here. There's some caterpillars here. Yeah, they're not hostile unless they're joining in with allies. Now I want to double check. Because one of those items was needed somewhere. Or I'm remembering incorrectly, which is entirely possible. Ripple Paradox. Gotta watch where we're going. Yeah, especially after that uh, warning that Tyon gave us about uh, about Black Fog being as dangerous as as it is. Okay. All things considered, the smaller the the ads are not quite as dangerous. Uh, let's see what your pattern is, right quick. Well, we've been found. We're unstoppable with you around, Senna. <laughs> I'm the girl with the gall. If you get far enough away from the pot potential ads, over in this corner seems pretty good. It might be able to call regardless. Okay, so I have days just in case. Oh, we have gotten really close to those ads. If somebody topples, come on. Well, I got the days off a little late, but. Launch does not work off of days, probably off of top of Okay. If Noah gets a little bit lower on health, it will be good. He builds up really quick at, at the current level of his on the skill gauge. This chain attack might not finish it. Ah, uh, let's see. Let's bypass defense first. Uh, da -da 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 -da. Seventy one. Uni might be able to. Yeah, okay, good. 
and put it to sleep. Interesting. Oh yeah, this chain attack is definitely helping. I've already got it down quite a bit. Oh, I've got some ads. Oh, this thing is dead. I didn't necessarily think killed by Jans right at that moment, but it was definitely dead. Um, I think I only have one attack left. So let's... There's... I'd really rather have, um... Who is it? Um... Who reduces aggro to healers and attackers? I can't remember off the top of my head. Um... This will end the... But yeah, chain attack. Definitely a big help against the... Well, actually no, I had chain attack when I fought, fought him before. I just, uh... It was the... Uh, combination of, um... It was the specific combination of uh, chain attack and. Should be time for dinner soon, right? And um. Or a Boris. Is this like a rare thing? So I think that was definite help there. It's kind of too bad that we don't have Ethel anymore. I would have. What's that? What's what? What did you see? Jans, what did you see? Maybe that rare Vang? No, you're up here. Did you see something up here? But I didn't get an uh a trigger for. This was a nice find. I don't know what he saw. Excellent. Okay, doesn't look like... Oh, no. You're... You look like you're great, but you're... Pasta. There's a rare Asper there. Ugh, it just spat something out. It's about to spit something out. Oh, but it meets. Uh, I don't care. You think you're all that, do ya? But if you attack me. <laughs> Why is it... Maybe level 15 or level... 
Okay, so maybe the level 15 is not... That's odd. You would, th you would think that, um... No, the level 15 is attacking. I... I'm not going to be able to get to that. I... You were to my... I was to your side a moment ago. That was spectacular. And I was the MVP. You were all thinking it. I want to see, because I think there is somewhere I can go from up here that might give me some extra stuff. Actually, real quick, uh, yes, I didn't notice that. Okay, um, we're gonna go ahead and use, that's fine. You, um, I want to go ahead and get that. Maybe I should save those, maybe I shouldn't, I don't know. Okay, so I have... Provide the perfect defense. You line him up, I'll knock him down. worry about what's better between episodes so I can actually go through and think about them. But, uh, let's go with this for now. Where? No, I don't think there's anywhere that I can maybe actually know that there might be. I just saw that path. So there's a path there. Decent, right? Okay, so you're... Okay. Let's increase evasion here. Part of the reason I'm also swapping characters every episode is going to be to get used to everything. There is an elite Asper up here. Treasure chest. That Asper is not going to go hostile or it didn't see me. 
What are you hiding, little guy? Wind bracelet? Don't just assume they're pushovers. Never a dull moment, eh? <laughs> Might not be the best place for an evasion field, let's be honest. I can't resist it. The ether defense down. Okay, I definitely need to get up. Um, the um oh what's it called um actually i don't know what this does oh, okay it's the same thing as you no heal all on hit was over way too soon. Hear that, Noah? Lance wants something a bit meatier. So he'll all. This was a nice find. Uni's um regeneration field is probably better. Is there anything else I can do here? Doesn't look like it's... Okay, that did not give me as much as I was hoping for, but that that container was probably worth it. Uh, so... Just need to remember that I can hit uh, ZL. And quickly bring up the uh, map for for this from there. Can't do too much, but may as well pick up uh, any items as I head back onto the story route. I've actually been using the um, the enlarged mini map more in Xenoblade 3 than I have in because <laughs> it's it is incredibly useful uh, to actually be able to see you think you're all that, do you? what is and what isn't filled in. Um, We're unstoppable with you around, Senna. Shall we deal with this? Would you leave me alone? You're... Oh, uh, might wanna. He is the most evasive. Actually, Noah in his current classes has pretty decent evasion. Um. Uni and her current class is evasive. And I was the MVP. You're all thinking it. Because Zephyrs are just... They're evasion tanks, which is good. Oh, I thought there was an item over here. Ah. Okay, I can't get up there right now. That's a battle that will probably give me affinity with... Wait, is this Keeps versus Agnes? Oops. Oh, I cannot assist the Agnes squad. I guess that does make sense. Oh, I've lost a lot of health. Yeah! <laughs> 
Okay. Kind of was losing control of that battle a little bit there. To the point where I haven't even been paying attention to the drops. Ion needs a little bit of healing. The flame, I'll finally be free of this eager's wilderness. Oh, hey, I just realized I left something back at four, so I ah, gotcha. <sighs> Am I getting close to that quest? Doesn't <sighs> maybe? Yeah, I'm getting closer. At we least. can't leave it like this. Actually, let's take a quick look. He's S rank. She's B. I may have looked at this earlier. She's D. B. C. And A. So. Am I gaining? I. I am gaining slowly. And it looks like I was not gaining when, um... Hey, this one means business. When, uh, oh, Ethel was the only one in the party with it. I probably also should take a closer look at my arts. See if there's anything better than... Oh, the invasion of wears off real quick. I need to... Yeah, because that evasion is not... I, it could be class rank as well, because... Um, because uh, class rank does seem to... Uh, strengthen certain arts. But yeah, I just need to build CP and progress. Uh, yeah, let's go ahead and fill in some more map before we actually do anything story related. I wonder if the Caterpiles have a um, event where they spit things out like aspers and uh or dig things up like um i forgot the name of those enemies already okay so those things over there that dig things up where are my, the rest of my Oh, they're stuck. Um... Come on, guys. Get your pathfinding. Get your pathfinding. Thank you. We're unstoppable with you around, Senna. I'm the girl with the gall. Oh, hello. Multiple... There's two elites right next to each other. Guarding a container. Hawks. That's Let's what they're called. Let's just sneak a peek. I can always defeat them off camera for the extra CP. Um, that's not on, that's up there, okay. I don't think there's anything else I can do. I 
Is this, like, a rare thing? I wonder what's around here. Okay. Hmm. SP it looks like it's pretty hard to gain, because I haven't seen it go up from levels or fights. I know it's grim, but it needs doing. Oh, this mix of environments. It looks like savanna, desert, and um, kind of a mountain, mountainous kind of area. Uh, I don't know that I can get to that container. Oh, um, but I can get to that quest. Is this going to count? Sweet, let's poke around. That's another fast travel point. Oh, that music. Is it high on? Yes. I'd really hoped it would turn out to be nothing. Ah, it seems someone else got here first. That gear must be a high rank colony. Lady Ouroboros, where they stand! I'd love to see you try, mate! Tie on, you are taking a ton of damage. Where okay. Tyon is probably not the Looney is taking some damage. Who is my land? Looney is taking some serious damage. Let's go ahead and evasion. Okay, Yumi's must have gotten killed by time, uh, not lands. Vanguard should be an attack. This is going to be unfair. This is going to be unfair. Ah. Uh, this is going to be unfair. Done with Yumi there. Oh, that's unfair. Damage.
That experience bonus, though. Oh, that was unfair. That was great. Hello. One hundred percent should be. What's with that bull rush? Hello, Whip Sword. You are a hero, one hundred percent guaranteed. What the? What was that? Pull back! I don't like our odds. They must be silver rank at least. Hello. Crude fighting wastes almost all your potential. And you? Good judgment, but you're a bad quitter. Just as I'd heard, sadly. Why do they all look like they could be heroes? I knew it! Colony Iota. I've heard about them. I bet you have. Commander Alexandria is famed for her keen wit. How dare you take Dame Alex's name in vain, scum! We've committed no crimes. I suppose you can prove that? Well, proving a negative isn't really possible. But. What you think you know isn't the whole truth. Eat this sucker! <laughs> Why? Dame Alex! Senna! I'm so there! Sorry to go off book on you folks. Snuff. That's enough. It will suffice for this little trial. You struggle for your lives in vain. Uroboros criminals. Those lives will be mine. This I swear. There are a bunch of morons just as we'd heard. And rude to boot. Indeed. But that might make for a fun reception. What you think you know is not the whole truth. Huh. I do hope you'll tell. Oh, I'm looking forward to this way too much. Looks like we managed to lose them. Uh, what in Her Majesty's ever-loving cheekbones just happened back there? Simply put, our foes were well-versed in the art of war, though their methods were inelegant, to say the least. Inelegant? Like war's ever pretty? <laughs> They're official at stockpiling combat rewards. That's how they managed to climb to silver rank already. I heard they even share their supplies with other colonies. That seems kind of awesome. Sharing supplies? Why would they do that? It would prove beneficial in the long term, I think. Creating debts to strengthen ties with other allied forces does open up your options, insofar as battle tactics are concerned. And if that leads to better results in combat, you can get your hands on even more goods. What I'm getting here is that they're trouble. Yes, and to make matters worse, Alexandria herself announced that they will come for us again. I bet us traitors would net them a hefty reward, huh? So how about we turn the tables on them? Punch their lights out! Listen to yourself, you doofus. We're talking <laughs> silver here, yeah? Well, whatever we choose to do, here's something to bear in mind. Colony Iota's commando group is made up of four units. Regardless of the proportions we take, we have a high chance of encountering them. We should consider our approach carefully. Well, in that case, in terms of sheer power, they're the ones with the advantage. We should avoid a direct confrontation. If we could just dismantle those commando units, it would help lower the colony's capabilities. 
And it might give us an opening to strike? Yeah, if it comes to that. But it basically allows us to avoid fighting as much as possible, right? I like that plan. No objections from me either. Personally, I'd hope we don't even meet them. We've made some new friends. Well, that... They don't like her too much? That's... interesting. Wait. Is it because they're in the same region? I have a bunch of new quest markers. Um, that's actually a little confusing to We've look made some at. New friends. We've made some new friends. Uh, yeah, they're they're friends. Oh, hello, level forty hawks. Oh, so that's how they're doing. I want to know your name, and I also want to get that item behind you. Here's a tough customer. Oh, so that's how they're doing. New colony entries have been registered. How did you not see me? So, uh, uh, okay. Another beautiful area. Sweet. Let's poke around. Armus, hawks. Wow, that put me in the middle of nowhere. What? Uh, might be able to get up to that. That looks like it might be a husk up there. Let's. I'm going to go see if that's a husk or not, and then go ahead and call the episode, because... Getting long in the tooth here. I think... That's a group of husks. Okay. Some wolves over there. Hang on. Is this the right way? Nope. This is... Guys, get ready to fight! I'm the one you want! Back! Fight! Cross impact! Wait for what? I'm actually surprised that that bolt hasn't joined in, but maybe it's just far enough away. Oh yeah, this is a massive looking battlefield. What are you guys? I know it's grim, but it needs doing. What colony will this affinity go towards? Do not know. I want up here, thank you very much. Don't... Are those Skeeters, maybe? Oh, there's another husk over there. There is so much to see and do in this field. Starting to get hungry now. Kind of insane. Okay, that's starting to fill up kind of nicely for the ones who have affinity for it, so. Like I said, this will be it for oh, today. My plumage is everywhere. So until next time, this will be Draco Breach reporting out. God bless and safe travels. And please remember to like, comment, and subscribe.